Hey guys, Sarah Carmen here, your not so secret agent, a newly minted broker here in Washington with Columbia River Realty powered by ERA and still your beloved broker over in the Portland metro area with ERA Freeman and Associates. And today we're gonna talk about multiple offers on a listing. Now for buyers, that is extremely stressful. This means that you are competing with multiple other people for the same house. There's a couple of things though that you need to know. Number one, if it's the home for you, it's gonna work out. So just take a breath, breathe, relax, namaste, it's gonna be fine. If you end up not getting selected, your home will be out there. It is stressful, getting multiple rejected offers is so heartbreaking but just keep in the fight. What you're gonna wanna do though, is make sure that your offer is your highest and best. This means making sure that you are giving everything you can. You're not going and saying, well, we can negotiate that later. No, do everything that you're willing to do, put it all out on the line and give them your highest offer and your best offer. Can you pay your closing fees yourself? Don't negotiate to have them do it. Can you go a little higher? Maybe you should, if the CMA warrants it. That's a conversation to have with your broker. Now, one of the other things as a buyer you should do if you're in a multiple offer situation is to possibly, if you're willing, write a letter. Tell the seller what you love about the home, the way you envision living in the home, what you think of their decor, what you think of the backyard, the location, how it's close to your work, or whatever the case may be. Tell them what you think makes the house special. Letting the seller know what you find special in the home gives you that leading edge. Sellers, you're gonna look at this and go, yes, we got multiple offers. This is the greatest thing ever, beautiful, we love it. Until you get to about offer three. Once you start getting multiple offers, and I'm talking three, four, five, 10, 20 offers, it is daunting and it is overwhelming. So I'm gonna give you a little bit of the same advice I just gave buyers, and that is to breathe. Take a minute, go through each offer individually. Write out what is it they're offering? What are they asking about closing costs? What are they looking at for repairs? Do all of those things and compare them then apples to apples, brass tacks to brass tacks, just get it down there and go, okay, which offer is best for me? And don't be worried about saying, well, yes, these guys are offering more, but I really feel like this offer is stronger. You don't have to take the highest offer. It might not be the best offer. So sit down and weigh out all of those things and know that we as your broker are sitting next to you willing to answer questions and to help give you all the information you need to look at each offer and decide which one is best for you. Multiple offers are extremely common right now, both in the Southwest Washington and Portland Metro area markets. That's because we have such little inventory. As of September, 2020, we're looking at one month of inventory in the Southwest Washington area and 1.1 months in the Portland Metro area. That means there are a lot of buyers competing for very few houses. It's a supply and demand situation. So going into that as a buyer, you need to know what it is you can offer and what it is you need to do to make your offer stand out. As a seller, you need to mentally prepare yourself for that possibility. This means knowing that you're going to be overwhelmed, but that you also make sure that you have that faith and trust placed in your broker to make sure that you can walk through this without any fear. All right, so I know it's stressful, I know it's crazy out there, but you guys, we're all in this together. If you have any more questions, feel free to drop them in the comments. I would love to talk to you. My email and all my contact information is below and I cannot wait to talk to you. Listen, thanks you guys so much for joining me and talking about multiple offers here in the Southwest Washington and the Portland Metro area markets. Again, I'm your not so secret agent and I can't wait to talk with you again. Thank <laughs> you.